obviously a car vlog because I'm in a car. And I'm running late because I'm always running. <laughs> I'm like, there's no way I can be on time. My ADHD has like been flaring up so bad lately. And <laughs> of course today I'm like, let me try this. Like I need it. It actually tastes kind of gross. But anywho, so many things to talk about. Uh, this cutie cutie is Sunny Blossom and she is from Free Trust Equal, which is my fave. I love Free Trust Equal. I'm pretty sure this is an older unit, um, mostly because of coloring. And the coloring is uh, SOP 144.8. And I actually really like this like chunky 90s coloring. Um, I know a lot of people don't. They really like more of an ombre or like a foliage or something um but you know I, lo I live for the 80s and 90s and I actually like this um the one thing that I did not notice about this unit when I reviewed it I don't think I haven't edited it yet um that was a night <laughs> if you go to my Instagram you'll see this I spent one Saturday evening like just reviewing wigs the whole night and I was drinking wine <laughs> And it's like, it's it's apparent to me as the night is progressing, I'm just getting like sillier and sillier. So if you see a couple videos where I'm like ridiculously silly, um, you'll know why. Anywho, but this unit doesn't have any combs in it, which I'm surprised that I didn't notice. And I'm hoping in the review that I did notice it, um, but when I edit it, I'll put it in um, on the screen. But like when I put it on this morning, I'm like, it doesn't have any combs. Um, I'm not really too concerned about it because I'm wearing it to work, but I don't know that I would wear this unit out. Um, I might have to put combs in it. I've been wanting to do a video where I add combs, so maybe this would be a good one to do it with and I could add the combs and like do an update or whatever. If you wanna see that, let me know if you wanna see a video on adding combs to a combless work. So um, a couple people have been asking questions and so I wanted to answer them. In this video, I want to talk about my favorite wig brands and my favorite online retailers. So I actually do have videos on these in my wig tips or my wig 101 playlist that you can watch, but it occurred to me like, potentially I would need to update those because it would change. So let's just start with my favorite online wig retailers. Top for me is wig types. I, every time I want to get a wig, I like from another site, I always check and make sure and almost like 99 times out of a hundred, the wig types is lower. I don't know if they like search and watch other you know other online retailers and just make sure that it's lower I'm not sure um, the only time that I would really want that I would purchase from another website is a if they were having a really good sale or B if they're carrying a wig that wig types doesn't carry and that does happen so um, my second favorite is glamour trust I feel like they do have a lot of sales um, sometimes I can find stuff cheaper on wig types and sometimes I can find stuff on Glamour Chest. So I all, almost always use one, <coughs> excuse me, one or two of those retailers. And I'll tell you what, wig types, lick a tea split. They come, uh, I'm like, I swear, did you just, I just ordered this. Like it's so fast. And Glamour Chest is pretty fast as well. Um, I also use... Elevate styles sometimes, but normally only if they're having a really good sale. And they do, when they clear stuff out, like they really clear stuff out. So I do um, like to use them for that. I'm gonna have to add something to that. It's got like an aspartame type situation. So I have recently bought some stuff from Black Hairspray. What was the hair sisters as well and i was pleased with their shipping um i obviously bought stuff on there i think it was because i bought some older units they were like priced to sell and also <clears throat> those two sites 
carry wigs that I wanted that Glamour Tress and wig types didn't carry. Um, but I didn't find their prices to be bad overall. Um, I feel like like the newer units on those are a little bit higher, but like the Clarence ones, you know I like a synthetic 20 or less. I'll go 30. It like hurts my soul to go $30, but like over $30. The only company I really purchase from that's over $30 is uh, Charisma, but I, I, I struggle with them. I do get some PR from Charisma, so that's nice, but still. Um, and lately I've actually been buying wigs from Poshmark. Uh, I sell my wigs on Poshmark and there's some units that I have found on Poshmark that like, and I buy them new. Um, like, I don't care if they've been used, but for a review, I prefer that they're new. Or if someone like tried it on and cut the lace off, I'm fine with that. But I don't want them to have like plucked out the part or put powder in it or like change the wig cap color just for the sake of a review. But if I was buying a wig just because I wanted it, I wouldn't care. Actually, I think it's kind of better because then they did all the freaking work for you. Um, so yeah, that, that's where I've been buying. And Poshmark is two day shipping all the time. Like it's all day two day shipping. So that's cool. So those are like the online retailers that I'm purchasing from right now. I do want to get, uh, I do want to start purchasing from Hair Remy. I want to get like some of their wigs. I just feel like anytime I'm ready to purchase from them, there's like a super good sale on wig types. But you can only get Hair Remy from Hair Remy. So I do want to purchase from them soon. I also want to purchase from Glee Made, which is the synthetic wig company of another wig reviewer her name's jess the dragon if you haven't checked her out check her out she has her own uh website so i do want to order from her there's this like orange sherbert wig that i'm like dying for dying for so yeah i was also going to talk about my top favorite wig brands but I ran out of time, so I will do that in my next car vlog. Um, I did want to show, because I've been trying to show this and people have been asking. Um, these are some of my handmade jewelry that I'm, these are my rings. I like the biggest ring possible. And this necklace, which has um, some agate stones, some crystals. So I'm going to be adding a lot of my handmade jewelry onto my Poshmark. I tend to lean more steampunk or like, I don't want to say natural, but sort of like yogi-esque bohemian. Um, those are usually the two lanes my jewelry ends up in. So yeah, that's what I have for you today. Um, my next topic then will be my top favorite wig brands. If you have some online retailers that you think I should try, please put them down below. Um, and, oh, I forgot Sam's Beauty. I also use Sam's Beauty. I think that their, their shipping's awesome. Their sales are awesome. Um, I like working their website because, like, the stuff stays in your cart even if you leave the website, and I really like that. Glamour Trust, it does not. You can leave a couple times, but then it empties your cart. Um, wig Types and Sam's Beauty, they don't do that, so I feel like I can put stuff in there and then come back. Like, I don't have to remember so I do love Sam's Beauty too. So sorry. I forgot you. Anyway, I hope you're having a super fabulous day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.